Hello, Leo. Happy birthday, Leo. This is special for you, Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I'm Brandy from ToriAndI.com. Thank you for joining me. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so we're going to jump right in. It's general. Okay, this is a dove. Doves do symbolize purity, hope, you know, like uh, messengers from back in the day. Uh, I do channel, but I am pulling these, so we'll see what comes out during that. Okay, you can always go to ToriAndI.com to book your personal. You may not always understand why certain things happen. However, there is always a higher purpose to the events in your life. Through turmoil, a blessing soon will be revealed. I hope this camera, there we go. You know what I mean? And that's true. I think we're all kind of going through that right now. I know there's like there was or is a major placement with your sign. With uh, the Venus retrograde and all that stuff going on. I'm going to get another one. The heart. The heart of your reading. You know what I mean? I look like some grief there, boys and girls. We're going to take the one that flew all the way over there. One, because it's beautiful. <laughs> all right. Friendships fell on top of that. You do have to have friendships before you can have love, and you have to have people who can back you up, whether that's uh, family or whatever. Wow. This is like healing and spiritual protection, the eye, just on the back, you know what I mean? The heart entanglement, the eyes placement of looking over to the heart, you know, it's like the heart of the matter. Time. You're trying too hard, which could be the grief, could be the breakup, you know what I mean? Like maybe you haven't given yourself time to fully process and you keep trying to, uh, push forward so to speak without giving things time or maybe you're bailing out on things before it's time giving up too soon and like that's just creating too much stress on you the turmoil that they're speaking of you know oh for the hell of it this one's got angel wings we'll go ahead and do some threes here again though this has hearts on it you know someone getting their wings that's the intuitive side of me the past is now behind you. Release it and embrace new possibilities. A new path is now available to you. Follow it with faith. Okay, so we have a present, we have a future, and we have a past. Like, there's no faith here. You know, things do die off, sadly. Things, unfortunate events happen. I mean, there's literal flipping toddlers out there being sold off and animals being mutilated. I can't give everyone the reasons why. You know? I mean, I can, <laughs> but I can't. Like, why is that happening? Mm, experimentation, evil, mm, we could go on and on and on. On and on and on. And on and on and on. So, Leo, let's grab you a... I haven't used any of these decks in so long, but I'm pulling them out for you. So, let's get a career. Sorry about that, let's continue. This is something for you. I lowered it so you guys can see maybe the cards a little better. Emma Goldman. Okay, you couldn't pay me to support capitalism. <laughs> Overthrow the state before it deports you. Immediate change requires doing the time. Isn't that funny? Time because you're trying to do hard and you're not giving things time. Like you're trying to bail out on something before you're supposed to. Like you've got to learn the rules before you break them. Right? That's what I would like to say. You have to learn the rules before you can break them. Look at Martha Stewart. I mean, she literally, like, <laughs> she learned the rules, she tried to overthrow them, but, uh, didn't work out so well. <laughs> I mean, she's doing all right now, but you get me. You get me. So, you gotta do the time if you're looking for something stable with, like, finances. 
birthday. <laughs> Geese spirit. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Let's get some good tarot for you, Leo. Hmm. Leo, Sun, Rising, and Venus. Oh! <gasps> What's in the current past? Affecting? Where was that? The tower. The tower jumped up with the Five of Cups. So I'm telling you right there. It's like a major sadness like the heart of the matter all of a sudden you know like this happened all of a sudden and there hasn't been enough time like you're not trying to you're not processing it you're covering it and you're not giving things time point blank point I need to raise this guy's getting on my nerves <laughs> to me I mean that could be like he fell off the wagon, could have gotten into a car wreck accident because of it, could have lost a job, could have lost a loved one. Present, please. Nine of Pentacles. Mm, value, value system. It's the value system because Seven of Pentacles is here too. Four of Pentacles is here. This is all like, nothing's happening. Like why, why don't I have the success that I need right now? Why don't I have that stability I need right now? You know, four of pentacles here. King of pentacles underneath the deck. Could be dealing with an earth sign by the way. Maybe you're waiting for someone stable. But uh, like, oh sorry, I didn't mean to put it that way, but look. seven. Son of Pentacles is looking over at the past. I feel like there's an eye here in the middle of the shell too, you know? It's just crazy how things fall out. This is a father figure. A late husband, a father figure, you know? A brother, whatever. It's a male character. It's a male character that maybe helped bring stability into your life. And it went away real fast. So that's affecting your present. That's affecting your uh, money, your stability. Like, I get it, but you're hanging on to the bad aspect instead of uh, dealing with them in a proper way, right? And if you're not wanting to work for the man, you're not giving your ideas, you're not giving you know, your business, your whatever, Queen of Pentacles, didn't even notice that, Queen of Pentacles under here, you're not giving it time to develop into anything, you're not learning the rules, you're not, you know, um, changing or modifying the behavior, and it's like, yeah, it's going to throw you out, you're never going to get there because you keep being like, okay, I did a whole day, what the heck? Yeah, that's, um, and it's like you've got you've got family supporting you. That's family. You may have lost a family, but that's definitely even friends could be family or online communities could be family. Whatever, they're there. The full for the future. Bum bum bum. That, my friend, is an idea taking shape. Six of Wands is under there as well, right? So this is an idea. This is pulling the trigger, but you got to put the time in. So maybe that's what you needed here. You know, happy birthday <laughs> for you to really understand. Like you've got to put a little more time into it. You've got to prioritize your commitments. You've got to do the details. You've got to, the fool is all about letting go of the past so you can get to the future. I mean, there's so many pinnacles popping out here. 
Mm-hmm. Death. Release. Bring back the childlike essence when it comes to ideas, fresh starts, the shedding, the shadow. It's trying to turn you towards the light. So this is the good tarot, but there's the sun. Didn't even see that. Queen of Pentacles again is under there. So, you know, this is going back to an idea that maybe you've put off and you didn't put enough time in. Maybe, the, you know, the, the child in you is still hurt. But you can see they're looking at it and they're releasing it. Almost like you're making that wish. And her hair, partially in the dark, partially in the light. So that is a transition to me. And her face is, I'm putting all of my soul that I have left here into this. This is it. I've got to do it. It's... You know, it's going to take me out either way. I would rather it take me out in a positive way. Right? In a positive way. If this has anything to do with a relationship. You know what I mean? Uh, you got, this is now. And this is going into October because of this. Also, death is like Scorpio. Sun is you, Leo. You got Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Aries, Pisces, Capricorn, Aries, Scorpio. I mean, these are all the, the people you could be dealing with. <sighs> yeah. Three of Air. Queen of Pentacles. You've got to turn your back on what you thought your life was supposed to look like so you can do something different. You can shape it in a different way so something good can come around to you, you know? This is releasing that idea of that person, that pain, to replace it with something great, a better vision. You know, you were little, you wanted something to happen, but, you know, you're not, em you're not embracing the new possibilities or the things that are being presented to you now and in the next few months, you know, you've got to put your all into it, not half hearted. It has to be all of you, right? You've got to listen to spirit. And I know spirit's been talking. I know spirit's been talking. They've been in someone's ear. I know it. You think you're maybe you're going crazy, but you're not. They've been there. They've been whispering. Look at that. The air. That's the talking card, too. Spirit ideas and the six is here someone could be six days someone could be six weeks someone could be six months you get me my hand shaking the empress that's uh taurus libra that is also uh marrying the project that is marrying the person coming in you know what i mean uh the blessings the creation, the creativity, the nurturing, the time. Like that's an, you know, someone could get pregnant, but that takes nine months. Maybe you got six more months, right? You got to learn a few new skill sets with the messenger of earth. But she's ready. She's ready, ready, ready. There's so many blessings here. We got the magician at the bottom. They're just trying to get you to see that for yourself. This is a really positive reading besides from like, um, well, we're just going to call that the heartache, Leo. The heartache. Wedding. I shit you not. Jesus. This says wedding, folks. Marriage is the union of two souls joined in love, mutual respect, and commitment. It signifies a desire to deepen love over time. Your wedding day is a testament to your well-founded faith in love's power continually breathe life into that faith and love dearest one yeah it's a whole restructure like this isn't supposed to be a normal like white uh, dress picket fence it's your love it's your love a change in direction and steady progress 
Change in direction and steady progress. We will read both. The changes you're experiencing are divinely directed by your newborn willingness to open your heart to love and our guidance. You are protected now and in the future. So follow your path to the happy outcome you desire. Exactly, the fool. The fool, the baby, the stork, the new direction. Focus on service. Right, spirit's been talking. Spirit's been talking and you ain't been listening. You know, you're not acknowledging for the progress that you've made and remembering love in your daily activities we can clearly see that the contribution you're making to the world through your thoughts your feelings and actions of love that's you giving your whole self to the purpose to getting yourself better to creating uh, the stability in your life you know your birthday month is usually a pretty powerful month for like change in direction epiphanies so forth and so on but there's something here about you servicing people but you've not asked you've not asked the right question or for the right help right your soul desires only to joyfully serve and to swim in a constant stream of bliss that this stream continuously feeds you everything that you need. Put your entire focus upon staying in this stream of giving and receiving in every situation and all that you do. Right, again, putting every, like, people try to juggle too many priorities and end up, like, failing miserably and burning out, right? So, I mean, whatever your situation is here, it is a general, but definitely felt a lot of sadness around someone's you know passing all right spirits what else for leo look at the bigger picture and balance spirituality and practicality my friend yeah so the bigger picture is the key to success, but you've got to balance, you know, practical um, ways to get there. The little small um, achievements, the small goals, they add up to the bigger picture, but you can't get to the bigger picture without practicality and faith. Practicality and faith. So you're gonna have to give more to this than you receive back right now but in the end you receive just as much back okay again if this resonates please hit like please subscribe should be right around her visit tori and I .com. and this was a beautiful reading besides you know you actually processing and releasing but uh you're right there so i'll catch you later leo